to Recipes Mania. So today we are at my house making Crystal's recipe for easy southern chicken. So to get started we have our chicken here in the pan which we've seasoned with some garlic powder. Keeping it simple today and we have cooked that up and we are frying some bacon over here and then we have some potatoes. We used three of them which we peeled and chopped. So we have everything cooked and we are ready to assemble it in our crock pot, which we have greased. What should we do first, Crystal? Okay, you see those two cans of cream of chicken soup? Yes, I do. They're going in first. All right. All right, so we've added three cans of water to that as Crystal's mom always taught her to add water to crock pot recipes. And we've got that mixed in and we are ready to go. What's next, Crystal? You see all those yummy potatoes? Yep, those potatoes that we peeled and chopped. Yep, all those are going next. All right. One more. All right, now what? Now you just mix that around. Looking good already. Now the chicken. Chicken. All right. All right. So our chicken is added in, and now we have five eggs here that we're going to crack. Okay, so we whisked the eggs, as you see there, and now we're going to pour them in. have our eggs mixed in and I'd say this is looking pretty good so far. Thanks. Now comes one of the good parts. All that bacon and the bacon grease as well. We have, uh, we did a pack of bacon, fried that up and we've got it in halves and some of them are in thirds and we're going to add that in. Plus all that yummy yummy grease. We're yep. not counting calories today. Well, you don't actually have to do the grease if you don't want to. But we do. But yeah, we're going to. It'll add some nice flavor for us. Yeah. All right, so we have that, all that yumminess mixed in. This is looking really good. If you're a parent out there looking for kid-pleasing recipes, this is for you. It's more sophisticated than your basic hot dogs and chicken nuggets, right? Yeah. And it's still something yummy, the kids will enjoy it. Easy to put together, even the night before, throw it in your crock pot, cook it all day, and be ready to go when you get home. Yep. And now, we save the best for last. I bet you can guess what that is, Renee. Would that be the cheese? Yes, and we are going to use that whole bag. Whole bag of cheddar cheese. Because it's a small bag, so. Yeah. Pour that on. Oh. Cheese is on, this is looking really yummy. We are gonna get that going on our crock pot on low for about four to eight hours. Or really as long as you have, the longer the better. We'll do as long as we can. This is gonna be really yummy for dinner tonight. Hope you try it, your kids try it. Uh, let us know what you think and we'll see you back here next time on Recipes Mania. Bye guys.